Now we have some more inputs coming in. And Prime Minister Narendra Modi spoke to the Indian cricket team on the phone today and congratulated the entire team for this historic victory that we witnessed last night. It was a nail-biting match, but we were able to beat South Africa by seven runs. It was uh, a, a very a nail-biting uh, and a, a full of suspense uh, match, but uh, at the end, we emerged victorious, euphoric celebrations going on across the country. People are celebrating since last night and now uh, Prime Minister Modi also in fact spoke with the Indian cricket team. Last night he had released a video congratulating the Indian cricket team to, and today we're learning that he in fact also spoke with the Indian cricket team and congratulated the entire team for this victory. This is the second victory of uh, Team India in the T20 World Cup. And CNN News 18's Aman Sharma is with us with more details on this. Aman, what more details are we gathering as far as the Prime Minister's conversation with the Indian cricket team is concerned? Uh, see, Anjali, obviously it's a big moment for the country, big moment for the Indian cricket team. And the Prime Minister is also elated and very, very happy over the achievements of the Indian cricket team. Last, team, last evening we saw... The Prime Minister posted a video message from his office uh, applauding the efforts of the entire Indian cricket team. And today we learned that the Prime Minister has spoken to the cricket team on the phone. He's congratulated the entire team. He's congratulated Rohit Sharma for his, you know, splendid captaincy, his entire T20 career. As we know, both Rohit Sharma and Virat Kohli have announced their retirement from T20 cricket. So the Prime Minister applauding their entire T20 career of Rohit Sharma. Uh, Virat Kohli, he specially lauded Virat Kohli for his innings in the final as well as his contribution to the Indian cricket. Uh, also appreciated Hardik Pandya, you know, the, for, the, for, the, for the final over that he bowled, which was responsible also in a way for Indian cricket team to win the final yesterday. He appreciated Surya Kumar Yadav for the uh, splendid, marvellous catch that he took uh, to uh, dismiss South African uh, batsmen. Uh, also, the Prime Minister has spoken highly of Jaspreet Bumrah's contribution. Jaspreet Bumrah was also the man of the tournament. And the Prime Minister appreciating his contribution. Prime Minister also making it a point to thank Rahul Dravid, uh, the coach of the Indian cricket team, for his contribution to Indian cricket. And, you know, the Prime Minister, you may remember Anjali in 2023 when India had been lost in the final of the 50-over World Cup. The Prime Minister had also come up with this heartwarming gesture of uh, visiting the Indian dressing room in Ahmedabad. After that World Cup final, you know, addressing the players and the coaches, uh, telling them, you know, to keep their spirits high and console the players who were very heartbroken after that loss. And today, when India has finally won the T20 World Cup, we see the Prime Minister joining in the celebrations, calling up the Indian cricket team, applauding the players and applauding the entire cricket team, especially Virat Kohli, Rohit Sharma, Jaspreet Bumrah, uh, Surya Kumar Yadav and the Indian cricket team coach, outgoing coach, uh, Mr. Rahul Dravid. All right, Aman, thank you so much for all those details. So Prime Minister Modi has also uh, spoken to the team, to the entire Indian cricket team, and he has, in fact, congratulated them for their excellent performance throughout the T20 World Cup. Now, 